Welcome to another edition of Talk Nerdy to Me. We're here at Phoenix Comic Con <laughs> with Camila Derek Dorico. Camila Dorico. Yeah. Camila Dorico. <laughs> um, you have some very unique artwork, as you can see behind us. Um, I read a little bit up about you. Uh, you really only got classically trained in like digital, and the rest you did on your own. Yeah, I was. I, I've done uh, classical training, but in my uh, art educational history, I was never taught how to do this style of art. So it was more. Painting, pointillism, or realism, um, or yeah, do trying the the digital. So this is a, a style that I learned on my own. And what was your influence? Well, I'm, I'm very influenced by manga. So and in Japanese aesthetics, and what I really love, um, and not only is the way that the way that they make the eyes really big and expressive, but right. the way they tell stories. So I I really enjoy how uh, Japanese comics are very character oriented, and they are they explore the characters' motivations, and the story is really just about them. So my artwork uh, expresses that. So every time I do a painting, I the elements of that painting uh, come together to form the puzzle of who that girl is. So you try to tell a story with each piece. Exactly, yeah. Awesome. Uh, I also noticed you, you're in more than one medium, like clothing lines and eyeglasses. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what else are you, got, are you working on that we might not know about? Well, uh, in July, I'm debuting my first uh, coloring book. So it's one of those adult coloring books where it's very popular. Real popular right now. Yeah, so fun. I, I really enjoy the idea of, of adults meditating while doing the coloring and getting lost. And I mean, you're, we, we have really busy lives, so I can appreciate taking that moment to just zone out and just color. Well, where will people be able to find this coloring book? So you can buy it um, on my website, which is store.camiladorico.com. Uh, like I said, it's only available in July. Uh, you can also get it at Chapters, Indigo, uh, Amazon, I'm sure. You know, I always appreciate when people buy direct from me, so. Cut <laughs> out that middleman. Well, you know, Amazon, I can't compete with their free shipping, but I do uh, sign my books online. So. Oh, so yeah. if they buy the coloring book, you'll sign the it's, coloring It'll book? be signed, yeah, awesome. online. So That's, that's a, a bonus. Yeah, that's a good little treat, you know. How much you get you to color it for? Oof, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't actually thought that people might want that. That's the first time I've, I've been asked Hand that. Hand-colored by, yeah. Oh my gosh. Never know. A million know. dollars. <laughs> no, but I yeah. would if someone asked me. For a million, <laughs> for a million dollars, yeah. For a million, I'll, I'll color, color the whole book. Um, but no, I'm going to run a, a coloring contest for it, where people can submit nice. entries to win uh, you know, the book or a sketch that I do uh, original for them. Very awesome. Yeah. Okay, so if they want to, uh, your shop has all of your products on it then, your eyeglasses and... Uh, no, I actually, the eyeglasses are sold through Coastal.com, Coastal. or if you're in Canada, uh, which I'm a native born, is... A, a. Yeah, a, I know, right? I'll drop a few A-bombs. Uh, it's called Clearly.ca, so you can get it so, there. And it's, it's basically your artwork on the frames. Yeah, yeah. It was a collaboration that I did. They approached me about doing this new line where my artwork would be featured on the frames. And I did. Uh, I really enjoyed working with them. And what we did, really special and unique on one of the frames, is that it has one of my old paintings on it. So we did the side, the the side of the frames right. with wood, so that it because I paint on wood, so it's an homage to my my trade. That's yeah, unique. yeah, it's really unique. Awesome. Um, is there anything you'd like to tell people? Sure. Uh, that maybe we didn't cover. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I've got uh, my new art book, Rainbow Children. It's with uh, published by Dark Horse. It's 180 pages of my artwork from 2012 to 2015. And then with Random House, I published a book, Pop Painting. And it is a step-by-step -step instructional book on how to use Holbein Dual Oils, which is what I use. So I paint on wood, and the book is a step-by-step -step guide, as well as uh, it doubles as an art book and motivational book. You know, for artists that are aspiring to become, you know, pa professionals. self taught like yourself. Exactly, exactly. yeah. Awesome. Well, uh, you've got a long line here at your yeah. booth, so I don't want to hold you up any longer. It's okay. Uh, I want to thank you for uh, letting us interview you yeah. here at Phoenix Comic Con. Uh, if you didn't catch it at the beginning, it was Camila Dorico. Yes. Got it right. Yep, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we'll make sure everybody buys your comic book or your coloring book when it comes out. That would be amazing. Yeah, make it a bestseller. <laughs> Definitely. Right? Yes. <laughs> thank All you right. so much. All right, thank you.